Excuse me. Um, Pastor Holcomb's on his way over. Do you mind not smoking in the house, please? Sorry. First round's on me. Now you're talking. Fucking constant. I swear this kid couldn't tie his own fucking shoes if you didn't show up. <laughs> <laughs> no, Val turns to me, right? But I'm looking at Carson. I'm thinking, excuse me, but what the fuck? Is that fucking bonehead still got his Ronald Reagan mask on? <laughs> <laughs> fucking Miley Am I supposed to know who this is? He blew his head off with a shotgun. I never met this guy before. How about this guy? You were a different man two years ago, weren't you, Jane? Life. And that all ended the day you were mugged. How, how long were you in the hospital, James? I don't remember. The wounds went away, but the nightmares. So you did what a lot of people do to try to escape. You swore that you'd never be a victim again. That's why you went upstairs and grabbed your shotgun after being punched in the face. But when you went back downstairs, you were too drunk and pissed off to know you went to the wrong floor. So you killed someone you never laid eyes on, James. There's nothing you can do to escape that. Any plans for a big day? Come on. She get out. You do something. Never know how many of these things you got left. What's her name? I used to hate birthdays when I was a kid. That's why I like celebrating yours. Her name? Took her and Eureka. Drove her out to the Headwaters Forest Preserve up on Elk River Road. 100 yards south of the trailhead, but under a big old sequoia. shoot anybody. Don't fucking puss on me right now, okay? Your gun's not even fucking loaded. I, 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 I'm, I'm, not, I'm not gonna do it. There you go. What are you talking about? Are you gonna back out on me right now? I don't wanna do it. Huh? No, are you gonna back out on me right now? I, 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 I don't wanna fucking Listen do it. to me! Listen to me! Are you gonna be a fucking pussy all your life? Huh? Are you gonna be a fucking pussy all your life? Are you gonna be a pussy? I'm huh? not doing huh? it. You gonna I'm be a pussy? Doing it. Remember high school? Everybody called you a pussy. I'm not pussy doing it. Huh? You gonna be a goddamn pussy? <laughs> huh? Fuck you! Let's Come on! Fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! Yeah! <laughs> yeah, baby! Let's go! Let's go!
Elroy. Elroy. What's you drinking, honey? Huh? What's you drinking? I take a little sip. Thought I'd invite y'all to a barbecue. Seeing as you're the one paid for it. <laughs> See you working like a good little boy. Huh? You typing away? <laughs> you keep plugging now. Huh? Okay. Keep plugging. Get back to it now, boy. You remember my brother? Maggie. Where are you going? Can I buy you a drink? Are you still doing that? Well, we ain't. <laughs> <laughs> my client has a right to testify in his own defense. Of course he does. Uh, one moment. So you see how this is going to go. Any sign of trouble from anyone, and Mackie gives her both barrels. So you folks are going to have to unshackle Bragg and parade him on out here, or she gets killed. I got you in my sights. Whatever happens to her, you're dead. Charlie, go get him. Could you please stop doing that? You didn't give me a good reason to. Because it's driving me fucking crazy. Not a good enough reason. Fuck is your problem, asshole? You're my dumb, dumb piece of shit. Don't move, my piece of shit. Asshole. You can't let Allison have that operation. The rules dictate that I, I cannot discuss this outside of the courtroom. My little girl is sick. Do you think I care about I, your rules? I understand what you're going through. Oh, yeah? You've had to sit there and watch while other people you don't even know decide what they're going to do to Mr. your Bear, kid. Mr. Barry, you have to stop. You're buying yourself a mistrial. I'm telling you, that doctor is not touching my kid, and I will see to that. Is that a threat? You take it any way you want. Mr. That operation is not happening. Mr. Barrett, you leave me no choice. I'm declaring a mistrial. What does that mean? I lose? I just don't want her to get hurt anymore. I can protect her. You can't protect her from everything. All you can do is to figure out what's best for what's her. What's best is to keep her alive. I don't care if the seizures make her like a baby again. I will take care of her. I am strong. They found chocolate in the little girl's stomach. We got wrappers all over the cab of the Indian's truck. Deputy! Mm. Come on, walk mm. like a policeman, Toby. You're a policeman. Mm. What about the noise? Don't shoot me! Don't shoot me! Don't shoot me! Is everyone okay? I thought he was gonna kill me. All right. You're all right. Well, we got these hostiles to deal with. Ain't a good idea of shooting each other. I said we put our troubles aside till we get there. Your word? My word. Maggie? My word, Cole. Give me guns, Eric. Mac, you got some clothes in there? Cover alley up. I've seen pretty much everything you got, Ali. No sense hiding it now. Go we'll dig in here. I'll take Brent, you take Mackie, then we'll deal upstairs. I always like this one. Yeah. Right, no one fuck with you or your loved ones. Right, Dave? Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> Pick up, Dave. Come on. 
Hey. Everybody called this guy just Ray. But Val here called him Ray Jingles. <laughs> you all right? I want to be sick. Okay. Use the back door, though, okay? You we don't like cleaning enough the toilet rip. Okay, bud. We'll go step by step. <laughs> You are near 40 years old, Alexandra. You wouldn't know what to do with a man. 